end of motorway 200 yards reduce speed now <laughs> how can i can i reduce more than this ah i guess everybody reduced oh look at him he's not reducing Good morning everyone, welcome back to the channel. My name is Florin, thank you very much for watching and thank you for subscribing. If you haven't done it yet, please subscribe and hit the bell button to enable notifications. That way you won't miss any of my new videos. This morning, I know what I'm doing <laughs> for a change. <laughs> um, just because this job was supposed to be uh, done yesterday uh, but um, they weren't ready so I'm going to Sheffield to collect some fencing panels they need to go to beautiful Somerset Somerset yeah um, after that I believe Turn left. Most likely, um, it will be Celsa in Cardiff, collecting some uh, rebars or spool, you know, coil, whatever. So, I think that that is the plan for today. Sun is shining, you know. Beautiful weather today. Yesterday was murky. Mm. Not nice at all. But today, sun is shining and we are happy. Now we should be here any minute now. You have reached your destination, Mangan Road. It no is one on is coming left. out. Are you going to let me? Thank you very much. Right. We're stopping here. Right. Guys, you know what? This... Uh, this place where I need to go in Shepton, Shepton Mullet. I think I've been there before. It's a, it's a farm, um, worthy farm. But I'm not. I think it's something to do with um, that music festival. What is was it called? Glastonbury. Glastonbury Festival. That's what it is, I'm telling you. I've been there before. I've been with uh, another load um, of fencing panels and they actually, they, they managed to Um, lose my my paperwork yeah that is the most horrible parking ever I'm not near I'm not even near where I need to be <laughs> my god what is this? Hey! Eh? 
what's going on? That's it. See? That is much better. <laughs> Right guys, I'll see you in a bit. Now I have to wait. Ready to go. We're going to Glastonbury Festival. Ah, yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah. Um, like I said earlier, I've been there before. They managed to lose my paperwork. I will, it, it wasn't a big issue. Um, it, it, it seemed like somebody, somebody's actually stole my paperwork. <laughs> they couldn't. They they didn't know who took my paperwork. Right. So this guy came. Um, you know, to verify the load, took the paperwork, and then it's gone. And then, uh, sometime later, somebody else came and said, uh, where's the paperwork? I said, I gave it to the guy already. What guy? Well, that guy. That guy with the Range Rover, he just, you know, you'll see in a minute what I mean. There's loads of people walking and driving around on that place. It's called Worthy Farm. It's really worthy. <laughs> it is a worthy farm. Yeah. But the ride there is beautiful. The, the place is uh, in a beautiful, beautiful area. Well, if you know Glastonbury Festival, then you probably know about um, that place. And this is the last load to go to Glastonbury Festival. He just told me there. Go right the on the roundabout and take so the third exit, A630. That's it, no Sydney more. Way. Thank God for that, they said. <laughs> right, guys, I've just joined M1. And I've got nearly 200 miles, four hours and 20 minutes. Obviously, I'm not gonna make it in one go. I need to take a break, 45 minutes break. So that's it really. Um, if everything's fine, I should be there for what, 1.45 plus 45 minutes, 2.30, around 2.30, yeah. Uh, hopefully they won't lose my paperwork again and they'll tip me fast so I can go to Cardiff from there. Right, I'm gonna stop in these services. After eight I've only just started, but I'm stopping in the services <laughs> because I see one of one of my ratchets handle. It's kind of opened and sticking out, so I don't know what happened there. So yeah, I'm gonna stop here and just have a look, see what's going on. Yeah, well, nothing major. It just came off the locks. It's got some locks there anyway. Um, because these fencing panels are made of um, aluminium tubes, they compress, right? Uh, in fact, the top ones uh, kind of get damaged when when you put the the straps on and that is because they really they bend right so uh, obviously while driving whilst driving they keep compressing and they keep uh, bending even more yeah and that makes the 
the straps loose. So that's why when you are going on a long journey, especially with these ones, straight on. ideally is to check the load regularly, you know, stop on your way a few times and check the straps. Yeah. Retighten the straps if you Although if you have to. Towards Nottingham for 37 miles. Where are you going, you idiots, with a car? I am slowing down so they, you know, this this trucks uh, have a chance to move over, and he's trying to overtake me. This one here. He nearly went in front of a of a truck that didn't have a chance to to go on the other side, you know, to change lanes. What an idiot! I am going to stop at Michael Wood Services. I'm kind of forced to take this break because there's massive delays after this. Uh, I was planning to stop at Abenmouth. However, uh, I think I'm gonna go over my time if I can if I continue. So that's why I'm saying I'm kind of forced to take a break now. But I'm gonna take a break now. And hopefully by the time I finish my break, everything will be clear. You never know. That's where I am going to stop. You will arrive at your destination at 1356. You stopped that caravan like an absolute bell end. That's it. Now I'm gonna start my break, have something to eat. And hopefully in 45 minutes, the congestion will clear. Yeah, that's it. Rejoining M5. And that's gonna take an hour and a half to get there, which means I will arrive at three o'clock now uh, the delays are still there it doesn't look like they've cleared uh, but I'm glad I took the break when I took it because otherwise I would have been in trouble <laughs> don't want to do that don't we no trouble here we are approaching Bristol <laughs> Nice traffic, nice traffic flow. <laughs> yeah, we will be there when we will be there. End of motorway, 200 yards. Reduce speed now. <laughs> How can I, can I reduce more than this? Ah, I guess everybody reduced. Oh, look at him. He's not reducing. There's some crazy traffic in this. Bristol. I've been here before. Um, 
I remember this very well. There will be some uh, very tight roads, um, bends, loads of bends, um, but yeah, beautiful, uh, beautiful road to drive onto, really. You see, I love this kind of drives. I absolutely love it. You know, roads like this are my favorite. Especially when they go through forests and villages, you know, little villages. It's, it's so beautiful. Okay, not long. Seven minutes, three miles. Um, I had to stop this camera for a while because um, it got overheated. It actually stopped itself. <laughs> Turned off. Yeah, and it wouldn't restart again. So I let it cool down a little bit. And uh, hopefully it's gonna stay on for another five, ten minutes until I get there. Uh, yeah, you see this? expensive camera yeah very sensitive the one that films in the front there is a 50 quid um from amazon china made in china anyway um, it's got good resolution and all that but it's not even 50 quid i think i paid 40 something anyway that one records no matter what yeah i think even if i throw it in water it will still record yeah i, I had it uh it dropped once from from the top here i had it on uh, one of the mirrors it just dropped and it kept going no problem but the expensive one very sensitive makes you wonder <laughs> that is tight mate come on that is really tight Need to give this guy a little bit of space. Oh my god, he got stuck. <laughs> oh, come on, mate! You're only touching the the bushes. We stuck again my god i only have 800 yards to get there ah that's why that's why
My friend. Hi, yeah. You all right? You've been here before? Yes. All right. <laughs> Change. There's the big roundabout. Yeah. Around the roundabout. Yeah. Down where the traffic is. Mm -hmm. Down the bottom. And I'll phone up Scott. Don't take the straps off till he gets there. He might want to take me somewhere else. Yeah. All right. Yeah. Cool. So now we are waiting for this guy to show up and tell us where they're gonna take this load off my trailer yeah and i shall see you then right he just he just showed up there's my glasses i'm gonna put these glasses on Right, let's get this off. Hi right, guys. Change of plans. We're not going to Cardiff, but I'm going to London. All the way from here. I've got a collection tomorrow. Tomorrow around noon couple of blocks away from Buckingham Palace yeah it's a bit stupid if I can say that uh, because I'm gonna have to drive now four hours and uh, I've got to take a break I don't have four hours. Right, I've got four hours and 19 minutes of drive available. Yeah. Love it. Absolutely love it. Actually, I don't mind it. Right. <laughs> let's, now let's see if I remember the way out from here. Huh? I don't really know, <laughs> to be honest. Um, yeah. I'll just go with the flow. Turn left. No. Did I come? I came from there. Why would I turn left? I don't know, man. I don't know. So guys, I'm thinking, I'm not gonna end this vlog because this part is quite short. So we're gonna continue tomorrow um, in London yeah on the second part of this vlog we're gonna have the crane part yeah <laughs> <laughs>